Um, I grew up in High Hill and my parents still live there. And my first job was a paper boy in High Hill as a 12 year old. And then I moved up to in the restaurant business and bartending and so forth. But been in business for 35 years. But prior to that, I was uh, working as a bartender, working my way through law school. And I encourage all our young students to get that job so they can save money for school to help out their parents because you work a, you learn a lot of work ethics by working as a student. And then when did you open this location here in Lake Orion? Uh, well, I ran for judge in 1993. We only lost by 174 votes. The community was so kind. My office was in Troy on Big Beaver Road. So I came up with the idea since the community was so kind to myself and my family and our supporters to buy a building, a piece of real estate here in Lake Orion. And I did that back in 1997. And it's one of the best things I did, a little bit of luck, and um, bought my building, paid for it. And with that, I've been here since 1997. But prior to that, I've been practicing law since 1988. I think it's an obligation for everybody to give back to the community, to give back to our schools. Never forget your roots, never forget where you come from. A lot of these people graduate and they forget where they come from. They act like big shots, but they're not big shots. In order to be successful, in my humble opinion, you need to give back. Uh, unfortunately, with COVID, we all stalled in the last three to four years, but I, I see everything turning around for the better. And I encourage our young people to get more involved. For example, the Lions Club, great organization. Since I've had kids, I have to be honest, haven't been as involved as I was pre-kids. But as a father, I have to have my responsibility to run a business and be a good parent. A judge once told me, no use being a great attorney if you can't be a great father. So my top priority is to be a great father, but being a great father means to try to be a father to our young people in our community and what I want to pass on to our youngsters in our community and youngsters meaning under the age of 40 uh, to be involved with, with a lot of our nonprofits we have too many to mention but they're all a class act but yet you get tired as you get older you get tired of serving it keeps you young but I have to be honest with you as you get older you get tired and uh, my obligation personally is to try to pass the torch to the younger generation it's a very important cause. It's uh, during a critical time period in our time of need. Usually uh, people get excited to help out during the holidays, but we need to help out every day of the week. I encourage everybody to be involved, support this drive that On TV is helping out with the community and the fish organization. Because when the fish organization benefits, our community benefits, it also gives motivation to our other nonprofits to be involved too. One hand helps the other.